We're starting off the video at a Dollar Tree. Oof. Ouch. Welcome back to another video. If you saw the last two videos, they were both insane. The first video, we got two supers. The second video, we went to the biggest diecast store I've ever seen. We're starting off the third video now, still with Gabriel and Ricardo. And we're starting it off at some random Walmart that I don't think either of us have ever been to. It's the car that you H opened case. in the last video. Yep. Some H case, finally. Ooh, I've not seen that yet. There's what would have been the super in the last case. This is, oh, that's GK. So there's the main line of the super. There's another one. Two of them in a row, GK, and here is, sorry, someone has been here. <laughs> someone has definitely been here. There's a new Miata. Don't have that yet. This is the most H case I've seen so far. Oh, don't have that yet either. Look at all these Mustang 20 cars in a row. Oh, there's Amex. That's right. Okay. That's kind of cool. Look, we got two main lines and a main line all in a row. So someone left their mark. Some more of these trucks. There's the skull. Just the fantasy is left over in the Jeep. Some Zamex up here. Oh my gosh. Yep. Oh, and a red Porsche. I think I only grabbed one of those. So we'll take that too. Watch those for me, Gabriel. Oh man, tons of them over here. Any of the new moving parts yet? It's 2000. Yeah, those are the ones I grabbed. Are you taking this? Mm -hmm. I was gonna be like. Yeah, those are. The, I told Gabriel to watch him. Uh, he didn't. <laughs> I'm tempted to buy that. I keep seeing it, and I really like it. 1949 Mercury Custom. Hey, I've never seen this one before. AMC Pacer. Three of those. Um, and um, wow, that's a lot. This is uh, maybe today is the day. What do you think of this thing? Oh. I've been wanting it. That's hot. Yeah, been eyeing that myself. I just haven't brought myself around it. It's like this. Oh, is that this the one? Is the this is the one you were talking about. about. Yeah, yeah. Are you going to grab it? I've done a lot of grabbing today. So I think I'm going to go with these for now. Oh, look, the Civic is in the 20 pack. I checked through some of it. Ethan. Oh. Gabriel is like most people. They drop them on the floor and they won't pick them up. This is how many <laughs> of the overstock for the Matchbox trucks this store has. Oh my gosh, I don't know. That's the guy you're talking about, man. And it takes like two hours. That pizza was actually pretty good. If you're in the Orlando area, check it out. I was actually impressed. I'm from Connecticut where pizza is like the best. Florida pizza hasn't been that good, but this place, delicious. All right, pizza was good, but you know what's better? Sealed cases at Dollar Tree. <sighs> Look at the top. Another one? Oh, that's the main line. Yeah, Bumble. It is a new one. There's a lot of cars here, though. Bumble. Nice. This was, dude, they just put this out, man. Here's another one. These just, just put out. Here's another one. Is that the real deal? Another one. F case. Alright, let's see. Let's go through these very carefully. Another one. Why is there so many? Yep. Find Remember, I'm looking for day E. Fiat back there. Another El Camino. Yeah, we're definitely not first here, but that's all right. Look how many duds. This is F case, right? Yeah, so dud, dud. <laughs> we got lucky, man. This is four cases of... Easily. Easily four cases of duds. And then, yeah, there's two of these per case, so... But no treasure hunts here either. We didn't find one treasure hunt. Have you checked for the white car? We don't talk about the white car anymore. We don't talk about the white car. The white car is dead to me. We're definitely not going to the five below to look for the white car. You seen that one before? Yeah, yeah, I have seen that one. As a matter of fact, at one point, I think that was a police car. I haven't never seen that. We are now checking out a Publix. Oh, look what's right there on the front peg. Did you get this yet? Yes, yes I did. Coop clip. Another clip. Why, why am I? Why did I not see any of these? And now they're everywhere. Moving on to another Publix. Well, there's this guy again. Ah, oh, you got a cookie. 
I knew that's where you went. The aisle's actually pretty stocked. Another Camino. I've seen those things everywhere today. It's so nice to know that we, that we already got the Supers. There's the M3. It's so good color, man. It is. It's such a good color. It looks just like a, uh, like a treasure hunt. Yep. It's so good. Walmart! You might want to tell them this story. Yeah, we uh, literally got in the highway, paid a toll, and then realized we passed the Walmart. So Ricardo just turned around, and here we are. You don't want to skip Walmart, I guess, right? I'm a soaker for punishment. Ricardo was on a mission. Look at him go. Perfect Hot Wheel hunting form. All right, so right off the back, PKs. These yeah. are new. Yeah. yeah Haven't seen either of these. Ooh, and another fire truck. Yep. Is this, this must be the wave with the SC1000, right? Oh, it's gonna be the hardest to find. There it is. I've only seen that one other time. There's a lot of them here, though. Holy cow, yeah, there's a whole bunch of them here. That's hot. Good ones. That's pretty cool. No, it'll say on it. It'll say Chase Piece. You'll know if you see it. It's really cool. It's really cool. I'm just trying to figure out where I'm going to put it on my work. We're still out here on the town in Orlando. We are near Disney right now. And uh, yeah, well, we ended up coming near Dollar Tree, so I figured let's stop. Thanks. Nope. Mm -hmm. Guys. So I'm walking down the aisle, and I see a Matchbox car, and I turn. Cheaper. It's just so strange because it was just like. <laughs> oh, the hunt is over. You weren't even looking for it. <laughs> I wasn't even looking for it. Not even a crazy one, but Dude. it is a crazy one now. What oh. a day! What a day! We found so many crazy things today, and that just pops up. Somehow. I knew when I saw that car popping up, I'm like, it's that's going to be it. I'm like, that's going to be it. I could just tell. It's just, 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 just the way it was sitting. Just, I just saw just that, and I'm like, it's going to be it. I had to go two hours from my house to find it. Two hours for Supers and the Porsche. Well, it's anyways. So off camera, Ricardo just said to me, you know, I don't have one, right, Mike? <laughs> so it looks like the new mission is to find one for Ricardo. All right, guys, before the video ends, I'm just going to go over what we got. That store was insane. Ricardo picked up this Kato House Mini GT Datsun Fairlady Z. This thing is properly cool. He said he's going to open it, so it will be freed out of the case. I don't have a Kato House yet, so maybe in the future I'll pick one up for myself. He also got this Porsche 964, number 28 out of the Boulevard set. I've never seen this. This looks very, very nice in the screen. That's a very interesting color. This is the same model that's orange in the premium Porsche set, isn't it? Yes, it is, Porsche 964. One of them I almost grabbed in the last video. Pretty cool. Oh yeah, that's gonna be the fan favorite. The Kaido House, number 27, Datsun 510 wagon. That thing is slammed. This is, getting, this is getting open too? Oh yeah. You're gonna have to send me pictures of these when you open them. Those do look sick. I'm excited. And then, he also picked up the Lamborghini Aventador GT Evo in the LB Silhouette Liberty Walk body kit on it. You know what, this isn't the same one that I have. I have the silver one. Mine is not the GT Evo. Mine is just an Aventador. I'm a little sad I didn't get one of these now, but that's all right, we're gonna go back. That is it for this three part series. I hope you enjoyed watching them. We had a blast making those videos and we had some insane luck. So let's go over what we got in all three of those videos. If you didn't see the first one, if you didn't see the second one, make sure you go watch them. The links are in the description and they will also be the last two videos on my channel. And for the end of this video, we have a little surprise here. These are not mine. These are courtesy of Ricardo. He said, take them home, open them up, 
put him in the video, and then give him back to me the next day. So we're going to get to see these before he even does. Thank you so much for that, Ricardo. I am so excited for that. I really am. But we finally found a stupid super treasure hunt on the pegs. Well, not in pegs. It was in a case. The story is we walked up to the aisle. The lady was there with the box. It was open already, and I said, hey, can we look at those? She said, absolutely, sure. So we looked through those. We hung them on the pegs for her. And then when she came around the corner, I said, hey, can I take this case with me? She said, absolutely, no problem. And I said, do you happen to have any more? And she just went like, and then she went like that. She wasn't putting them out. She just said she'll let us look through them. And to my surprise, I pull out the El Camino Super Treasure Hunt. Ricardo had the other case and he pulled a second. Insane luck. The chances of that out of just two cases alone is insane. So that was really cool. This thing is really, really sweet. The sun is kind of setting, but you can see the Spectre Flame paint on it is super, super pretty. Rubber tires. Heck yeah, man. It's so nice finding your own Super Treasure Hunts. It's such a great feeling. It, you just don't get the same when you buy them secondhand. So that was awesome. We also found some of these in the case that she had already on the shelf. That one was an E case, and obviously the Super Treasure Hunt that we grabbed was an F case. So I grabbed two more Civics, love customizing them, and I grabbed a couple of these as well. And then we hit up a Target afterwards, grabbed this super cool Pontiac GTO. Look at the color on this. It's absolutely insane. Let's try to do a late, late day sun check. Man, that is stellar, dude. It's not really Spectre Flame, but it is super, super bright. Really excited about that. That's a cool one. And the VW car here, the Coffer Racer. And then of course we got this treasure hunt here. I actually gave Ricardo the one we found first and this is the one that we're gonna give away. So to win that giveaway guys, you just gotta like, subscribe, take a screenshot of all that and send it to mikeshowieplanet at gmail.com and we'll draw the winner. That was the first video. In the second video, we hit up that insane store. And if guys, if you didn't see that video, you gotta go watch it right now. It was absolutely mind blowing. I left with this black Porsche 911 GT2 RS. Had to have some serious self control in that store. We're gonna save that for later videos. But Ricardo bought a whole bunch of stuff, including these two, and we're gonna unbox those in a minute. And then in this video, we found a Walmart, and I finally found one of these on the shelf, the Porsche 904 Carrera GTS in silver. This thing is super sweet. This is out of HK, so we're still missing a lot of cars from HK. I grabbed another Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7. This one's out of G. I had only ever grabbed one of these when I saw it, so I figured it was finally time. Grabbed another with Zamac, Mustang, funny cars, always a good one to grab. The King Cuda in the art cars with the King card paint job on it. That thing's really, really cool. Ace and King on it. That's awesome. A Miata MX-5 15 out of HK. It's the orange one. We love this casting. It's always so cool in all the different colors. And a 1964 Chevy Seville SS in red. That's a really cool looking car. So those are some cars out of HK that I did not have. Afterwards, we hit up another Walmart, and I found this Bizzarini 5300 GT Corsa Revol Revival Moving Parts. And this is actually a real car, guys. I looked it up. It is a real car, in fact. And it sells for about $1.6 to $2 million. It's very, very cool looking. I may have to open this. I'm not too sure. And then, guys, it finally happened. Here it is. The Porsche 911 GT3 in white. It's more like an off-white. This car has been evading me for months and months and months. If you guys watch my channel, you'll know this. Um, this is a pivotal moment in my channel. Honestly, it's just as exciting to find this on the pegs as it was to find the Super because I've just been looking forever for this car. So I'm getting attacked by bugs. We're gonna go inside and I'm gonna open these cars. We're inside now, the bugs are starting to get to me. So this one here is a Kaida Haas Mini GT Dotson Fairlady Z. This thing's really cool. Honestly, Ricardo, if this makes me start wanting to buy Kaido houses, I'm gonna blame you. Oh, look at that. That is super detailed, holy crap. Kaido house is made by Mini GT, guys. All right, next up we have the Datsun. Okay, that one's pretty sick. Even the bottom is like anodized. Oh, wow. Yo, that is super clean. There you go, guys. There are the two kind of house cars we got to open courtesy of Ricardo. Thank you, Ricardo, for that. That's pretty cool. We got some winners right here, man. That's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed watching that three-part series. We had a blast making it. This is not the last time. We always have fun hanging out with Ricardo. And we found the white Porsche. We finally found the stupid car.